the camera actually captured the settling of Martian dust as Viking landed on July 20th, 1976, more than two million miles from home. This is Innovation Now, bringing you stories of revolutionary ideas, emerging technologies, and the people behind the concepts that shape the future. The Viking Project, managed by teams at NASA Langley, gave us our first high-resolution images of Mars. Here's Dr. Joel Levine, research professor from the College of William and Mary, who spent 41 years at Langley. Let me talk about what we learned from Viking, and, and one way to do it is we've heard about Mariner 4 and 6 and 7. Mariner 4 obtained 22 images of the surface of Mars. Mariner 6, another flyby, obtained 25 images. Mariner 7 obtained 33 images. The Viking orbiters obtained 52,000 images. 52,000 images of the surface of Mars. And the interesting thing is that we are still analyzing the Viking images. And the pictures Viking sent to Earth are helping scientists today pick landing sites for Mars missions in the future. For Innovation Now, I'm Jennifer Pulley. Innovation Now is produced by the National Institute of Aerospace through collaboration with NASA.